23 seconds. That's how long it takes for a thief to steal your car. He stole my truck off the parking lot here. I just went in to grab baby formula for my baby, and it probably took me about five to seven minutes, and the truck was gone. It was that quick. It's an estimated eight and a half billion dollar a year industry, according to the FBI, with more than 400,000 vehicles stolen from right here in the borderland. Is organized crime stealing it to make money? That's what it's all about. That's yeah, heartbreaking. <laughs> and your vehicle is on the top of their list. Last year, 1,100 trucks and SUVs were stolen here in the borderland. That averages about three thefts a day. This year, we're only seeing two thefts a day, but Ford owners are especially concerned. We know that uh, the F-250s and the F-350s do not have the security feature in those that, was, that were placed into the F-150s. So the F-250s and F-350s, number one, are easier to steal. And then number two, they are in demand by the organized crime groups in Mexico. Theft is a nationwide problem, but the borderland has seen a surge as drug and human smuggling continues, with businesses in Pebble Hills targeted nearly every day, according to authorities, who say there's no end in sight. So how can you protect your vehicle? The best deterrent is lock the vehicle and take the keys with you. Having your dealership etch a unique serial number in the windows is also an option. That number is then put into a database, so if the vehicle is stolen and say that goes to a chop shop and the police raid a chop shop, well then they can check to see by that number that yes indeed that vehicle was stolen. If your etched vehicle is stolen, you'll be paid up to $4,000 above your insurance for a new vehicle and rental car. Of course, additional alarms are good options. A $5 fuel cutoff switch fortified this pickup. An additional alarm system made it unstealable. Skylar Zwick, KDBC 4 News.